Can you get Discord on your Galaxy Watch 4, 5 or 6? Well, the answer is yes. You can now get Discord on your Galaxy Watch and stay connected with your community on the go. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can install and use Discord on your Galaxy Watch. So without further ado, let's get to it. As you may already know, currently there is no official method to install Discord on your Samsung Watch as there is no Discord app for Wear OS. But don't worry, I'm going to show you how you can easily install and use Discord on your Galaxy Watch. First, you will have to install the ADB tool and Discord APK on your smartphone, which you will later sideload on your Galaxy Watch. To do that, open the Play Store on your phone and install the Bug Yeager application. After that, install the Discord APK on your smartphone using the link in the description. Next, you have to enable the developer mode on your Galaxy Watch and then turn on wireless debugging to make your Galaxy Watch ready for sideloading the Discord app. Before proceeding, make sure that your watch is connected to the Wi-Fi. To enable developer mode, open settings on your Galaxy Watch and go to About Watch. Then, open Software Information and tap on Software Version 5 times. Next, go to the Developer Options and turn the ADB Debugging toggle on. Scroll down, tap on Wireless Debugging, turn on the toggle and tap on Allow. Now you will see the IP address and port number of your Samsung watch and with this, your Galaxy watch is ready to sideload apps. Open the Bug Yeager app on your smartphone, tap on the connect device icon and select pair. Now go to the wireless debugging section on your Galaxy watch and tap on pair new device. Enter the pairing code from your Galaxy watch into the Bug Yeager app open on your phone and tap on pair. It can take multiple tries as my Galaxy watch got paired on the second try. After this, your phone and Galaxy Watch will be successfully paired for wireless debugging. Now go to the Packages section on the Bug Yeager app and tap on the Add icon. Choose Select APK File and tap on OK. Now you just have to select the Discord APK file that you have downloaded on your smartphone and the installation process will commence. Shortly, the Discord app will be installed on your Galaxy Watch. What Discord features can you access on Galaxy Watch? In my experience, I was able to access almost all the things that I normally do while on Discord. Although it's not as efficient as navigating Discord on your smartphone or desktop, and it definitely takes some getting used to it. But after you get the hang of it, I can say it's pretty usable. I was able to access all the servers along with all their content, including videos and other media files as well. Groups and Friends List by accessing group chats and friend lists, I was easily able to engage in conversations. I was able to engage in individual conversations through text, make calls to my friends and receive incoming voice calls. I effectively made and attended video calls on Discord from my Galaxy Watch. But as most smartwatches don't have cameras, the other person was only able to get the audio from my end. If you like this video so far, then please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Now coming back to the video. By opening the notification tile, I had access to all the notifications I got on my Discord. I was able to open the profile section which allowed me to make changes to my Discord account and profile. Since the Discord app is not optimized for Wear OS, there are some issues or functions that you might not be able to access properly. You could also face some trouble while navigating the interface. But don't worry, you also have an option to customize the DPI of your watch so you can get a better view of the screen layout. Bear in mind though. By changing the DPI of your Galaxy Watch, the contents of the display will get smaller. So, if you have a poor eyesight, it might not be suitable for you. However, you can easily reverse it and change the contents of the display back to their original size. To change the DPI of your Galaxy Watch, open the Bug Yeager app and connect your Galaxy Watch through it for wireless debugging. Go to the command section and tap on the code icon. Now type in WM Density 150 and enter by tapping the play icon. This will change the DPI of your Galaxy Watch screen and make the contents smaller so that they fit on the watch screen. To turn the screen back to normal, type in WM Density Reset and the contents of the watch display will revert back to their original size. All in all, Discord on Galaxy Watch will let you stay connected to your communities and friends. You will be able to access a lot of features through it. However, the navigation requires some getting used to it. If you found this video informative, then give it a thumbs up and comment on what you would like us to cover next. For more informative videos like this, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you don't miss any updates. 
That's it for today's video. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.